Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Robo Tycoon 3 Coast to Coast with your host, Cher, currently playing... What the hell are we on? Whatever comes after the Flying Scotsman. Is it crossing the Alps, maybe? Hmm. Well, why don't we take a look, shall we? Let's go load our game. Uh, well, that's what we did in England. So I need to pause here, and I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, so we're in the European section. And yep, crossing the Alps is next. I'll see you guys in one second. The Alps! Them's one tough chunk of rocks, that's for sure. For centuries, it's been a difficult barrier, and made travel from Italy to Germany too costly for commerce. That's where the train come in. See... Getting through and making a connection to the north and south means a whole new world for Europe. Yep, treasure in commerce was to be had by those brave enough to challenge them mountains. Sure is one heck of a rock, though. Alright, so apparently it's one heck of a rock. The craggy mountain pass of the Alps are a natural barrier, blah 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 blah. The year is 1875. We have to connect Milan to Zurich, Switzerland by 1910. So we have 35 years, or let's do Milan, Zurich, Munich, and Venice at the same time period, or we have to do all of that and haul 30 loads of weapons to Munich and cannot lay unconnected track. Okay, so we can do multiple companies? Interesting. I don't think I've ever tried that, but that sounds like an interesting concept. Anyway. I can't believe we have so much time. 35 years is quite a bit. So we can do multiple companies. What an idea. I'm really tempted to try that, because going from, you know, Munich to Augsburg or something like that would be kind of cool. Anyway, let's see. What do we start with? That's a good that's a good question. I don't know. Oh yeah, I guess we do have to start a company. Fuck. So we could. Oh, we're going to have to use almost all our money anyway. Alright, let's just use all our money. What do we do? Actually, grapes sound like a good idea since we are in Italy. Where's the grapes? There we go. Wait, that's not grapes. That's just a... Oh, God damn it, I thought it was some fucking grapes. Hmm. I don't see anything very fitting. There we go. Okay, well... There we go. Alps are pussies. <laughs> okay, so we used all our money, so now we can't start a second company. Anyway, let's see where we have access. We have access to Italy, and Slovenia, and Croatia. That's nice and all, except there's no goddamn towns in Slovenia or Croatia, so what good is it? The only thing over here is a fucking iron mine. Oh, whatever. So we eventually have to get from Venice and Milan, both of them, up to Zurich and Munich. So we have to connect up those four cities, which are, you know, pretty fucking far away from each other. And yeah, they, they're they're through these mountains. You want to see how tall these things are? Holy fucking shit! I mean, that's some terrain for you. You know? Look at that. You know? Fucking ridiculous. So yeah, that's why it was a huge a huge deal for everyone in Europe. Because, you know, getting goods back and forth through this terrain is just crap. Innsbruck. Alright, so let's take a look. How much does it cost to get to Austria? 500k, and Germany, 1 mil. Switzerland, 500k. Not that bad. So our only restriction is we can't build unconnected track. We can do another company if we want. I'm wondering if we could get a second company that started up here in Germany, because, you know... Ah, oh, well, whatever. So 1875 probably has some decent trains available at this time period. Can't buy a locomotive until you place some track, so let's go ahead and place some track. We eventually want to connect Milan and Venice, so we might, might as well do that now, you know? 
Let's uh, start a derp a derp. Uh, yeah, like, uh, well. trying to think if we can save a little cash by doing only one maintenance facility, you know? You dig? Of course you dig. I know you follow me. Yeah, let's do right here, and we can do a maintenance facility before we split the track. Like that, we'll lock it. Uh, like that. Perfect. Then we go this way. You know, we want to run over to Verona. We could also go this way to Trieste and Porto Guaro. Clogging for not a whole lot up there. So let's first loop around to Porto Guaro. Make sure we're using cheap bridges. We are. Good, good. Uh, flexible. Uh, whatever. It'll work. Ooh, consolidation or stir consolidation, obviously. Fucking awesome shit. Cramped it. No, we'll do consolidation. It's good. Not making a whole lot of money on that route, but that's okay. We'll go this way. Hopefully make some more dough, because I like dough. I like bread, too. Uh, we're running out of money there. Might be okay though. Let's see if we can issue some stock. Yes, good. Issue some stock. Perfect. Station, please. Ah, oh, doesn't fit. Please to be track. Station, please. Thank you. Um. Yeah, that'll work. All right. So what we're gonna do is give this guy double duty. He's gonna go Porto Guaro and then back to Venice and then over to Verona. Because we can't afford a second train right now, so this guy's gonna have to do it all for us. So, yeah, there we go. Let's get rid of the dividend. Since there's, uh, oh yeah, there's no competition on this map. It's just us. There's no other dudes, no other companies, no nothing. It's just a, a goal that we have to achieve in 35 years. So let's unpause and watch our little train do its trainy winny thing. And once he's arrived over there, and what the? All his profit just disappeared. What the fuck? He had profit and now it's gone. What the shit just happened? Last time I looked at this, it said we were going to make money on this route, and now we're going to make zero. God damn it. You, you would think a game that was made in, I don't know, 2002 or whatever, would have all its bugs fixed by now, but no, it doesn't. So we just made nothing on that. That's bullshit. Well, you better make something on the return trip. There we go. Good lad. We're going to fast forward, though, because I'm pissed at you right now. Mm. Choo -choo. I'm a train. Rawr. All right, 48K. That's enough for a water thingy. So let's put a water thingy. Oh, there's some profit for you. 185K hauling weapons. Nice. Choo-choo. Awesome. So now we get a maintenance facility right about there. And he's hauling nothing back to Venice. You fucking loser. What the fuck? There has to be something that people in Venice want. Oh, that's right. We need another water thingy over here. Fuck me. Jesus, 17k profit. Come on. You can do better than that, sir. Well, whatever. He's just making a little dough going back. Choo choo. Consolidation sounds so fucking awesome. This train is boss. This engine is boss, I mean. I 
weapons. Okay. Still hauling weapons. Profit. Oh yeah, the stock again. He's hauling something back. He's still not hauling anything back. God damn it! Fucking useless. Why are you not hauling anything back? Verona, you have freight. What freight do you have? What do you have? You have grain. Really? All you have here is fucking grain. God damn it. Okay, so. Over here, you have nothing that takes anything from grain. So what we need is a brewery. So we should build a brewery in Venice, and then we'll make money off all this goddamn grain. Yeah, I get it. We're... no, 10% on a loan is too much. I want a brewery. How much do they cost? Two million just to build them. Jesus Christ. What else is on the map? Is there any livestock? Whatever. Uh, there is no livestock in the south. It's all in the north. Damn. What about logs? Not really. Not a whole lot of logs. Uh, milk always. Produce. Oh, oh, oh. A brand new distillery, and it's cheap. And it's right next to a fucking produce orchard. Hell yeah. Buy that shit. We need some dollar dues. And take a loan. 10%. Fuck me. Whatever. We're doing it because this guy is profitable. Don't prove me wrong here. Stay profitable, okay? And we'll run a train over there too eventually. When we can fucking afford it. Actually, another bond would be fine. Let's just do another bond so that we can connect over here. Come on. It's not that bad. Come on. Ah, oh, shit. It is that bad, because... It looks like it's stable land, but there's actually water there somehow. There we go. Much better. Perfect. Alright, new train, please. Consolidation, please. And please to be making money. Oh, we don't even have 30k to put a fucking water tower down. Whatever. Oops. There we go. Water tower. Still hauling shit to Verona. Good for you. You got nothing to go back to Trieste. Because you suck. We're actually going to swap these around. Uh, yeah, I'm going to delete this thing because I don't like it. Sir, are gonna go to Trieste, back to Puerto Guaro, back to Venice. So you're gonna go back and forth to these three, and you're just gonna stick to Verona. So let's swap you around. There. Stop breaking down, you dumbass. And yeah, we're making okay profit on this distillery. I would like more. There's only one goddamn produce farm, produce farm, so it's not really enough to be super profitable.
you're profitable, but not super profitable. That's fine. Seagulls at the port, of course. That's 100 grand if we connect to it. It's not worth it. <laughs> we may connect there anyway, but we're not going to do it for the 100 grand bonus. Hmm, profit. Alright, let's issue some more stock. We have some decent money. This guy is not making huge profits, but whatever. I want to build a. Uh, What's its derp here? Yeah. There we go. Now we can afford it. Brewery. Fuck yeah. Right there in Venice. We own that shit. And it's going to make us all sorts of profit, you'll see. We took out three loans for this shit, and it's already making money. Hell yeah. As soon as we can, we're going to have to pay back some of these loans. 11%, <laughs> 12% loan? Ew. It's okay, though. This guy's profitable. We might even have to upgrade this asshole. Nothing to haul back to Venice. Really? That's just sad. I wonder if we have room to upgrade this station. We do not. Fuck, this house is in the way for upgrading. Well, I'm not going to delete a house. Hooray, profit. I like profit. How about this one that we bought? No, this guy's not so good. Sell it. Yeah. Now we can pay back one of these crappy ass loans. from Verona. It's sad, but it's true. All these rivers here, it really makes travel expensive back and forth. Cause building bridges is not cheap. It also slows down your trains, you know? But it's all good. Toy factory, don't care. So we can pay back another loan, let's do that. Keep issuing stock. Mmm, profit. And he hasn't even... He has not even reached the point that he's producing as much as possible, so he can still produce more. That's fantastic. We'll just let him get awesome. I do like profit. I wish I could give this thing a hug. It's doing so good for us. Let me pay back a loan. Good.
this this scenario is not that hard. I mean, it is if you're if you don't know how to do it. But I think I have a pretty good idea of how to do it. Just kind of build around Italy, get as profitable as you can, and then save up money. And then when you can afford it, you need to build a goddamn huge tunnel. <laughs> I mean, you could just do uh, railroad tracks, you know, you can crisscross back and forth through these valleys, but I kind of don't like to do that. I just build a tunnel, <laughs> usually from like... I usually tunnel from here, through this mountain, to this little area, and then from this area I tunnel through here, over to here. It's like a straight line from there to there. It's, just, it's like 15 million dollars just to build that tunnel, it's ridiculous. Hey, our stock split good for us. Alright, so we're good profitability. Let's connect over to Milan. That's the next step. Let's, uh, let's go around the farm, eh? Can we please not have huge grades in our track? I hate grades higher than like three. There. Perfect. Thank you for not being stupid. Oh, that, that station's going to cover everything here. Awesome. Money, please. Money, please. I asked nicely. There we go. Now I need more money so I can... Ooh, a truck that's good at climbing. The Shea 2 truck. It's cheap to buy. Customers think it's okay, or passengers think it's okay, and it's, you know, it's decently quick, but still pretty slow. Anyway, let's run our route from Milan over to Verona, using that wonderful consolidation. And we can't even build a, a herbert or water thing, because we're out of money. There we go, now we can do it. Water right there. And you're not really hauling much away. For some reason, Verona doesn't really have much to offer. There's nothing that it gives back to the community. We're gonna... Oh, we can't upgrade it for some reason. God damn it. Fuck you, Verona. We're gonna destroy that station. And build a new one. I want to be able to cover all the little buildings over here. So, there. Gotta rename it to Verona. Just like nothing ever changed. And now our trains need to make sure they go to Verona. That covers a huge area now. You are wonderfully profitable, and you've actually reached your production limit, so we might consider upgrading you, but for now, we'll just leave you the way you are. Perfectly awesome. Ooh, weapons. Delicious. Let's go ahead and buy access up here with all that money that we have. We should probably repay some of our loans too, because we can get them at 5% right now, which is awesome. Come on, money. Oh yeah, we need a maintenance facility as well.
doing fine. We have another 26 years. It's a long ass time. What did it say about weapons? 30 loads of weapons to Munich. Okay. Weapons come in at the dock, I get it, I guess. Supplies 5. Supplies 5. Yeah. Weapons come in at the docks. And we could bring steel over, but there's no fucking steel because... Because there's no iron or coal anywhere near the steel mill, so what's the fucking point? It's just retarded. Loans are paid off. Good for us. Verona, you really need to grow up. Get some industries that don't suck balls. Also make profit on down here. Grain, livestock. There's no real livestock down here. Wool. Well, there's some wool. The textile mill. It's making good profit. That might be a good buy. 950k. Or just build our own. How much it costs to build a textile mill? 1.2. Yeah, if we built our own, it might be nice. But, uh, eh. Man, profit has really tapered off down here. That kind of sucks. Probably some motherfucker like this guy. Bakery stealing our profits. I'm gonna delete you, bakery. <laughs> My profits, bitch. Oh, another bakery. Die. You're still making good money. Where's your lumber come from? Oh, there's two lumber yards now. Yeah, I got a new one down here. I see. I see how it is. Is there any other lumber around here? Yes, there is. So it might be worth building a lumber mill up here somewhere. Or just in Milan. Kind of slowing, whatever. Oh yeah, we haven't been issuing stock. Derp -a -derp. Sometimes I'm just stupid. Let's go ahead and buy rights here in Germany. Still need rights in uh, Switzerland as well. But that can probably wait till the last second. How much is it for a lumber mill? 1.5 mil. Oh my god, the stars are spinning around the map. A dairy processor? I don't even remember what that building does. I don't see it on the map. I'm sure it's here somewhere. I just, I'm blind. I don't see it. Try to make some profit off these clowns. We'll build a lumber mill down here in uh, Milan. Go 
Come on, give me 1.5 mil. Pretty please with sugar on top. Please. I would like some dollary dues, please. Almost. Oh, come on. Don't tease me, bro. Almost. Oh, so close. There we go. Hooray! So he's gonna get the lumber from there. It's just gonna come right down. I mean the logs. And then the lumber will get hauled over this way. This will make money by... Uh, we should probably buy this farm at the logging camp as well. There we go. So we'll make money... Uh, from the logging camp selling its logs to the lumber mill and then we'll make money at the lumber mill selling its lumber to the train station then we'll make money from the train station hauling it to the other train station it's amazing but we'll be at negative profit for a little bit because it takes a while for the resources to become in demand because they're not in demand yet it will eventually be in demand you can see that it's getting a little brighter here. This will eventually get yellow. Alright, so we've got access everywhere. Good for us. seeing the demand too much here. Come on. It should be bright yellow by now. How's our brewery doing? Still good profit. Oh, another grain farm spawned. That's why. Brand new grain farm. We'll buy that. That's nice. Stable explosives. Tunnel cost dropped 15%. Very nice. Sounds good to me, broski. Shouldn't just buy everything. If I keep buying everything, I won't have any goddamn money. Alright, here comes the logs. They're starting to come down. Bonds are at 6%, so we could take 10 million right now, but we'll need more than that. You can take a maximum of 10 million in bonds. Oh, shit, we're out of time. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed our time together today. Please join us next time. We'll try to finish this map crossing the Alps. As always, please comment, rate, and subscribe. If you have any suggestions or uh, ideas what we should do for this map, do let me know. And join us next time, where we'll try to finish this up. Bye-bye, everybody.